Hello again everyone and welcome to your daily tarot and today we're going to get one tarot card from the Shadowscapes tarot deck. We're also going to get one card from the, there we go, energy oracle cards. These are really great. You can see what kind of energy is around you and supporting you right now. And we're also going to get one of our goddess power oracle cards. Oh, in here. I didn't show you the Shadowscape. So there's the Shadowscape tarot card that we're going to be working with as well. These are quick, short, sweet little messages about um, circumstances and energy around you right now. And we will get started. You can skip ahead to um, your timestamp if you've already got your own way to intuitively, intuitively pick your number. Um, those of you that don't, we're just going to do a quick little meditation right now. You're going to close your eyes and take a deep breath and imagine yourself just sitting on a beach chair. You can hear the waves and the ocean lapping along the shore. It's very quiet. Your eyes are closed. You're just relaxing. And you hear a bird. You open your eyes, you hear a bird. And you look up and there's a seagull. Oh, and what's flying by? There's a balloon. There's a balloon flying by with a number on it. So you stand up out of your chair and you reach for the balloon. You just grab it in time. You just reach the string. You pull that balloon down and turn it around and there's a number written on that balloon. What number is that? That's the number that Spirit is asking you to pick today. All right. So now we're going to get ready. We're going to go right to pile number one. So let's see what pile number one is bringing you today. So your Shadowscape Tarot card. Oh my, you are getting the Two of Cups. This is very beautiful. This is Soulmate, Twin Flame, Energy. It could be um, a very good partnership with a friend as well. And let's see what the tarot, the uh, little booklet for the Shadowscape Tarot is telling us for the Two of Cups for you today. The Two of Cups, making a connection, a union, a partnership. It is the bringing together of opposites and the potential for bonding. It is a relationship. This is very nice. So let's see what, this is the first time I'm using the Energy Oracle cards. Um, in a video. I've been using them for a little while now and I'm really enjoying the energy behind them. I've connected with them really quickly. Oh my gosh. Wow. Door to romance. <gasps> and look at the synchronicity. You have 33. So you may even be seeing numbers like that popping up. I got to put these two beside each other. This is amazing. I love it. This is the first time I've used these Oracle energy cards and the first deck we've picked is really resonating so much with the uh the tarot card the two of cups and this is your door to romance so this is probably not um just a deep friendship this is a romantic union all right so now let's see what goddess energy is behind this compassion oh my gosh that's beautiful so this compassion behind this union in relationship that you're forging towards Today, I'm just gonna let those, you can just sit there and take that in. That is beautiful, my gosh, to be you today. That is awesome. Lucky you, pile number one. Really, please leave a comment, let me know. I would love to know the details of that. That is an awesome pick. All right, let's go to pile number two. So for pile number two, your Shadowscape Tarot card today is the Hierophant. Now this is a very different depiction of the Hierophant from a lot of other tarot cards. This Hierophant to me is really grounded. He's part of the earth. You can see how he uses his divine energy and brings it down, which is sort of symbolic of the Hierophant. But I find this one is very much in balance with the world around him. Okay, let's see what the Shadowscape book says to us today. For your energy of the Hierophant. The Hierophant's roots reach deep 
entwined around secrets and traditions and the ages. He believes in ritual and ceremony, in pursuing knowledge and deeper meaning, and in the rigidity of a belief system. He is the teacher who can help unravel mysteries. So you may actually have kind of a deep experience coming your way today. Or maybe this is something that you've been progressing through. A knowledge that you've been digging deeper about things on yourself that you want to know or others around you. So let's see what energy oracle card you have with you today. Oh wow, the sixth chakra with Archangel Metatron. So this is really about clear thinking, intuition, wow, which is sort of what the Hierophant is bringing in today. So really go with your ideas and your thoughts today. Okay, and what goddess energy do you have around you today? Earth, Gaia. Oh my gosh, wow. Is really cool I love these cards they're just connecting so quickly I find some oracle or tarot cards it can take a little while to connect with them and receive intuitive messages but these ones are really I've connected with these quite quickly and I think it's beautiful here we can see how the Hierophant is bringing in this divine energy and bringing it down to earth and here you are being supported by Archangel Metatron through the third eye beautiful Really beautiful for pile number two today. Congratulations. Please leave a comment in the comment section. I would like to know more about how some of these readings are resonating with some of you. Okay, so we're going to pile number three. Let's see what the tarot is telling me today. Ooh, the tower. Okay, so some big changes. Uh, changes in direction. Let's see what the the um, the Shadowscape book is going to tell us about your tarot card today. The Tower, catastrophe, sudden change, crisis, releasing all emotion, suffering a blow to the ego, revelation, and seen through illusions. A necessary disruption to the status quo. Violent and explosive upheaval as only the way to break through the long established patterns. So there may be something that's been going on in your life that has been sort of like weighing you down. It's not supportive to your, your growth, your inner growth. And you're going to have a revelation about this today and it's time to break that. It's time to break that pattern. It's time to break that relationship, really, because you need to always move forward and keep growing. And you should really only be in situations that allow you to do that. And sometimes growth can be a little bit painful. But let's see who is supporting you in your energy today. Anxiety. So that's actually, yeah, okay. So don't be surprised if you're feeling a little bit anxious about these changes that are happening. We always feel anxious when changes start to occur, especially if they're big changes. Um, but with change is always like I, every, every door that closes, a door opens. So, and through those doors are many opportunities for growth. And I think this is a time for you to start growing in a new way. So just allow yourself to feel that it's normal. Don't try to fight it. If you feel anxious, that's the feeling you're going to have today and just accept it and know that it will pass just as everything does. And what God is power is with you today and supporting you through this rebirth isis wow this is a very powerful god rebirth so this is whatever is happening for you today this is a time for new growth so you sort of need to just accept that the old old patterns old relationships whatever it is it's going to need to go so that you can open up again to rebirth and to continue to grow and move forward to better opportunities for you. Okay? So just be gentle with yourself today. You're really gonna deserve that. And that was number three. And please leave a comment in the comment section. I hope you guys have a good day. And I know you're gonna get through whatever's going on with you right now. You have a lot of support from your guardian angels and your spirit guides. 
So we're gonna do number four. So pile number four. So your um, Shadowscape Tarot card for today is the sun. Excellent energy. Quite beautiful, oh my gosh. There's so much behind the sun. The sun card to me represents everything good. Everything good, all possibilities. And let's see what the author's little quote is for the sun card that she created. The sun, enlightenment and understanding, glory achieving prominence, the constant renewal of life, of vitality, and of being filled with radiant joy, energy, invigoration, and good health, being full of assurance and confidence, a clarity of vision, and purpose lit by the clear daylight. So you guys are really moving into some excellent energy today. You're, I, th I feel like you're really manifesting things that you've been hoping for and desiring, and it's actually, it's coming through now. It's all around you. So let's see what energy is in the Oracle cards for you today. Journey, absolutely. Look at you go, yeah, this is awesome. Look at all the light here that this person is creating and working with and bringing in and sort of like just letting it go to create this world, this idea of life that you want for yourself. And you've now packed your bags and you're ready to go. And this, this card reminds me a lot of the Fool card in the tarot. She's just ready to step off that bridge and she's gonna go. So she's got her lantern, she's, her way is being lit and she's prepared. This is great, I love that energy. Off you go guys, you're gonna have a great day. And who is the goddess supporting you today? Ellen Pattern. So this card is asking you to um, recognize patterns in your life that you may have noticed that have beneficial outcomes. So certain patterns, whether it's patterns of how other people behave or actions that you take that give you beneficial outcomes. So this is sort of helping to guide you on this journey to this better life, this idea that you have for yourself. I really like that one. This is a very inspirational. Number four is great. Oh, that's awesome. Sometimes I wish I could be with you guys on these journeys. They sound awesome. Something really exciting happening for you guys for pile number four for today. And that's it. And thank you. Please leave a comment in the comment section. Like, subscribe, hit the bell so you know when I've uploaded a new video for your daily tarot. And that's it, guys. Have a wonderful day and really take care of yourselves.